Hi right, guys, and welcome to the tutorial. We'll go through some of the basic fundamental kicks of tricking, um, and then what I'll do is progress into some of the harder kicks. But these are fundamentals that you're going to need. Okay, so we'll start with the three main fundamental kicks, which is the round, hook, and crescent. Okay, so the round kick, we're going to use our right leg if you spin left, like me. Okay, so nice couple stance, we're going to use the cheat setup. That back leg's going round, knee nice and high, lean back, your toes can uh, point backwards if you want. It allows you to get your leg a bit higher. Um, and then as it comes round, follow it round, let the kick out, and follow the momentum. Okay, now with the uh, crescent kick, we're going to use the opposite leg. And the crescent is a nice straight leg, a big sort of arc. All it is, just that motion. Okay, and then the hook is the same, but we're going to bend the leg chamber and let the kick out. Okay, so up, around, and just like that. Okay, so tips for all of them try and get your hips nice and square. So if I'm doing my round kick, I want to be parallel to the target, so my legs get full range of motion. Same with the uh, round of the hook, uh, sorry, the crescent of the hook, uh, the hook more side on. And then with the uh, crescent, you can turn your hips right um, straight on. So your leg, all it is is straight leg up like that. So it's going over, up, and around. Okay, so those three can be incorporated into all the kicks in tricking. Yeah. And I'd suggest the first trick to learn would be the tornado. Okay, so we need this cheese setup. Um, use the uh, arms. We're really going to pull that uh, momentum in using the big shape to the small shapes technique. Okay, so in the kicks, we're spinning on a horizontal. Um, axis. So when our arms are spinning, they need to want to be on a vertical axis so that they can generate a lot of spin um, by using just opening and closing your arms. Okay. So if you watch closely when I do the tornado, as I start to spin, my arms come out, then they enter the spin, my arms come in, and then that kick comes out at the end. Okay, so as I'm doing it, as you can see, and um, that knee coming up just to pop off those toes, all that with the arms as well, gets the height. You generate that twist by bringing the arms in, create that small shape, generate the momentum, and then last of all, opening out, spotting your target, and letting that leg fly to where you want to go. Okay, so that's the tornado. Um, and again, another good tip is always try and complete this, uh, a good amount of uh, rotation. So, Finishing here, it's going to be a lot harder to enter another trick. Okay, so uh, the pop three can be next. Okay, again, we're going to use the pop set of this time. So, feet together, again, same technique. You're going to have your arms out, pull them in to generate that twist, and then as you're coming out, landing, arms out, generate the uh, to degenerate the twist, and let that kick come out. So, there's one example. A little bit there, but you see, as I go up, arms out, pulling it into the general bit of momentum, and then again, keeping that hips, trying getting that targeting so you're completing the right amount of rotation allows you to get that kick out a lot, uh, out a lot easier. Okay, so there's the two first uh, most fundamental kicks in tricking. Give it up and practice, and then once you've got those, I recommend if you go onto the 540 or the 720. Uh, and then the world's yours. Hope you get it, keep practicing, and I'll see you in the next video.